In this video, I want to introduce you to the really great image gallery component called Ignite Gallery. Now, I have installed it here on my website, and I've created a main main gallery category and a subcategory. And you can easily create more categories by clicking on New Category. I usually have set a menu link to display the main gallery and so any new category I create should then be under the main gallery so I can easily see see it on the front end of the website. Now click on manage images on any of the categories to manage the images associated with that category and when you get there you'll be able to easily Either add files or drag files across. I'll drag a file across. And the system will automatically scale down and resize pictures that are too large to, to make them the right size for what we need. Now for each picture that has been uploaded, you can then edit a description. You can create a link to it by simply clicking edit and here you can add a description that pops up when a person views the picture now if you want to edit the settings for how pictures are displayed you can go to profiles I've set up one here called gallery and the, the image options really are quite straightforward uh, whether you want to have round corners for the large image, round corners for thumbnail images, the size of the thumbnails, and so on. Now, viewing the website, you can see how we've added our soccer picture here. And you click on it, and it comes up in a nice preview. And our subcategories is up here, and uh, you can then view all the pictures in that category. Now, one of the benefits of the Ignite Gallery is that it, en it enables front-end uploading of pictures. So we'll create a link called Upload Photos. Again, one has to then choose which category one wants to upload the pictures to before one can upload pictures. So uh, we will choose subcategory. And we are back to the familiar screen. We'll take this photo this time. See, seems like there's a problem with that photo. I'll try a different, different one from my system. Start upload. And there we go. And there's the photo. So I hope this helps. It gives you an introduction to the Ignite Gallery system and it's, it's easy to use and user-friendly.